Picks and Parlay family, it's me, Detroit Lenny, here to talk a little NFL, give you a little free action for week 10 of the NFL. We're going to talk to New Orleans Saints and the Vikings, and to do that, we're going to bring in Nick Earl from Earl Sports Bets, talk a little NFL action. How's the NFL been treating you, my friend? Oh, it was good. Last week was a nice week. Uh, this week's off to a strong start. Had Carolina in the under for Thursday night, so those come through there. And uh, I actually really like this game, so I'm glad I got it. Okay, let's talk about this. The New Orleans Saints minus three at the Minnesota Vikings. Uh, the Viking or the Vi Saints are minus three. The Vikings hosting. I'm still a little confused by that. I don't know. I think the wrong team fair. Whatever. You get into that. Total sits at 40 and a half. Talk to me about this one. Where are you going? Man, you stole my line for this breakdown. The wrong team is favored. Yes, 100% agree. And there's a reason why the wrong team is favored in this game. It's because of the quarterback situation with the Minnesota Vikings. It's obviously not Kirk Cousins. He's done for the year. They picked up Joshua Dobbs, who's still learning the offense. I'm aware about that. But we cashed a ticket fading the Saints laying points last week. Uh, and we're going to go ahead and do the exact same thing this week. I don't mind the Saints as a team overall. Uh, as a favorite, absolutely not, though. This team is 5-4, and four, but they're 2-6-1 and one ATS. On the flip side, the Vikings are 5-4, four, and four, and they're 5-3-1 and one ATS. The, Sa the Saints are coming in off of back-to-back -back wins. They beat the Colts 38-27. They did cover as two-point favorites in that game. And they did not cover as 10-point favorites against the Bears. I loved the Bears last week. I had the Bears last week. So, uh, But previous to that, they lost back-to-back -back games against Jacksonville and Houston. Didn't look good there. They beat New England 34-0, which has been bad this year. Their only other wins were against Carolina and Tennessee, who haven't been very good either. And on the flip side, we have the Vikings, where they finally have flipped the switch this season. They started off terrible this year. 0-3, 1-4. They lost. They had, they had a decently tough schedule to start the year, though. Tampa Bay, yeah, whatever. In Philly, against the Chargers, and against the, the Chiefs for their four losses. They beat the Panthers. They beat the uh, Bears. And then they pulled off an upset against the San Francisco 49ers. And then the previous two weeks, they beat the Packers and the Falcons. I think the Packers and the Falcons are about the same level of competition as these New Orleans Saints. So the wrong team is favorite for me. Give me a little skull here. I'm going to take the money line at plus 125. I, I also got them up to eight and a half in a teaser. Uh, I'll probably grab some three. Uh, if that's around on Sunday, I'll probably grab some plus three of the Vikings as well. But the wrong team is favored in this game. Give me Minnesota uh, and Joshua Dobbs to get the win here and continue their hot streak. I mean, I guess. Uh, listen, as a Lions fan, we know one thing. We have to keep winning because this, the Vikings are coming. They're yep, gonna, yeah. they, 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 they're, they have just as easy schedule as we do. So, I mean, it, you know, I think they're going to continue to win. They're finding ways to win, and they're banged up. That's what's scary about the Vikings. So I like the Vikings here as well. I like them on the three. I'll take the points. Uh, you know, or it's cringy. This could be a three-point game, line, but uh, if they cover the three, I think they went out right. Fair enough. Uh, don't forget, if you're looking for more from Earl Sports Bets, check out picksandparlays.net. Use the promo code NCAAF. That'll save you 20% off your entire site over there. Till then, though. We're going to take the Vikings plus the points, money line, whatever makes you feel comfortable. Vikings all the way is what we're going with. I'm Detroit Lenny Picks and Parlays. Nick Earl, Earl Sports Bets. Good luck unless you're against this.